Our um, back porch, patio, whatever you want to call it. The landlord has been told about this back here that there's several leaks on it. It stays nasty all the time. And I've got a ton of movies that I want to watch at some point. Um, Sean Connery, Lawrence Fishburne, Just Called. I have got a slew of these The Ghost in the Darkness. I don't know about that one. Class action, that might be something I want to watch. But I'm going to actually something see with what a mess. And I didn't realize these things was getting wet. Like Water for Chalk, one of the year's best forbidden love. I'm gonna throw away a bunch of these things. The Unfaithful, Richard Gere and Diane Lane. And Spider-Man. Look Who's Talking, John Travolta, Kurt Sealy. I have got a slew of these things. Here's one. Bill Murray, Quick Chance, Gina Davis, Randy Quaid. Randy Quaid. Randy Quaid, isn't he the one that, uh, isn't he the one that, uh, Fell off the deep end, so to speak. Jumping Jack Flash. That's not what's in here. Jumping Jack Flash. This is quick change. So they got this in the wrong box. Jumping Jack Flash doesn't say, you know, this looks like new. Oh, I suppose. Look who's talking that. You know, unless these boxes are dry, I'm not going to. Spider Man. Uh, Tom Selleck, Steve Gutenberg, Ted Danson, Three Men and a Baby. These things look brand new. But 
Now here, see, these are stuck. The Trouble with Angels. Who is that? That box can go. Something time for romance. Now, this appears to be a black, uh, at the risk of sounding racist, which I'm not, uh, these, these movies like this are a lot of the movies that are pretty much black. oriented and that ain't even that ain't even a full movie that is junk uh devil's advocate Yeah, let me. These boxes have got damp. The seas. That is, uh, something to do with the White House, something, it being under attack or something, I remember, and just cause Sean Connery These are, by the way, this is dumpster finds. These are dumpster finds. And I suppose <sighs> this is a lot of men of honor. Robert De Niro, and I don't like De Niro. I like his movies, but De Niro, I do not like. De Niro is one of them people, because he's a good actor, He thinks he knows what's best for our country. And he don't have a clue. He thinks he does. Whoops, I better shut up. I'm Tombstone. Now that is uh, a good movie. Uh, I can't. That's going to have to be separate. Now the gladiators, this box is in bad shape. Who was in that? Russell Crowe. I knew that. I knew that. Now, 
Richie gear and this box is in pretty good shape so I'll leave that I wish I could run to the I'm afraid to go to Ricochet who is that I don't know is that a I mean some black movies I like but some, it's, I can look these titles up and tell who's in them. They're driving Miss Daisy. That's the woman, Morgan Freeman. I like Morgan Freeman. I don't know what his politics are. And, but he made a statement one time about racism and how it's gonna stop. And Morgan Freeman said, you stop calling me a black man and I'll stop calling you a white man. You're a man. Now, folks, that makes a whole lot of sense. Quit calling, but that, you know, that covers a whole thing. Quit calling a, a Native American. Quit calling him an Indian or a Native American. He's a man. It's a woman. And... That tagging somebody with a, something like that, that's the problem. We try to make a difference in people. And uh, the fog, that sounds interesting. That sounds interesting. And look who's talking. That's in pretty good shape, so I'll leave that in the box oh man I'm afraid this is going to be a there's the Indiana Jones oh, man them stuck together Bill Murray screws I like Bill Murray Julia Roberts is Aaron Brockovich. That's that movie about a reporter that was killed or something, or it was political. Be motivated as good as it gets. They had these are these are run. These boxes are run as good as it gets. I can't even tell who's in that. I would have to look these up. These are all stuck together. Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. New Jack City. That don't sound like something I'd want to watch, but I'll... To Kill a Mockingbird. That was a good movie. I could watch that again. I could watch that again. Now see, these are all stuck together. Babs, Martin Landbury, Holly Berry, Black American Princess. Now that, these pretty women are clueless. Always funny and gorgeous. Eh. I'll hang on to that one. It sounds.
canister. I can't even tell what that is. Wesley Snipes. Now, I like Wesley Snipes. Passenger 57. You know, Samuel Jackson and Kevin Spacey. What is this? The negotiator. He frees hostages for a living. Now he's taking hostages to survive. That sounds interesting. I'm going to have to tear it out because it stuck in there. Negotiator. I wish it wasn't rainy. I need to go to... I need to go to... Pull, look at this back pole. I swear it... And we... It just... The weather blows leaves and dirt and dust in here. And we still got a lot of stuff in here that, well, you know what, I may, I may have to I don't think I'm going to wait. Yoga. Yoga class video. What the heck is that about? Carmen. Now, bitch. Oh, is that all about yoga? <sighs> Yoga class, yep, don't interest me at all. Gee whiz. The Last of the Mohegans. That might be a good, good movie. Maybe. The Mask of Zorro. Anthony Hopkins, and you know that won't even answer me. That won't. Interest me at all. Won't. My lady friend that has yard sales might like to have some of these. The Running Man, a game nobody survives, but Schwarzenegger has yet to play. Okay, that's Arnold. I like Arnold Schwarzenegger. All these such things. Just kindergarten cop, that's Schwarzenegger. Tom Hanks, Castaway, that was a good movie. I'm going to take that out of the box. That's the way. 
the Schwarzenegger in the box. What was this one? Two thumbs up. That looks like Wesley Snipes. Uh, Blue Streak. I don't have a clue. Master Jewel Thief. Wider. Part two. Who was in that? Why the, let's see. Uh, Kevin Costner, Dennis Quaid, and Gene Hackman. Bette Midler, Lily Tomlin, Big Midler, mixed up at birth. Two, set, two sets of twins finally meet the match. Box is in bad shape, but so I'm gonna... I like Bette Midler, I like Lily Tomlin. Oh, it's fixing to rain again. Folks, I've absolutely got a mess out here, and I've got, I've got to put this high on my agenda. Well, the thing about it, the landlord, if they ain't going to get out here and fix stuff like they're supposed to do when it goes kaput, and I mean, at least stuff gets wet. Oh. It's ridiculous. I see us having to move. And I hate moving. We've been here five years. But it's, they don't want to make repairs. And as far as I'm concerned, we're paying right at $1,000 a month to be here. Um, it's not working out. I'm almost tempted. There's some apartments... We're thinking about getting a four-bedroom apartment, and I like the area this is in. It's close. Uh, let's see. Is it within... It's fairly close to a Publix. It's close to the Walmart where my daughter and my middle grandson works. And it's also got dumpsters close by that I don't have to get out on the road to get to. 
Um. And I wouldn't be able to have a little scrap shop or anything, but it's very close to a neighborhood storage place. And I could rent a storage unit in there, one of those uh, 12 by 15s or 12 by 20s and use that for my little scrap shop. So, thinking about that, but that's going to be on towards the end of the year before we decide to do that or if we're going to do that. And I've got stuff strode around again. Uh, uh, it's so much rain going on, you can't get it used to. I can get out here in the morning and go to work. Now, there's so much rain going on. Oh, Lord, what a mess. What a freaking mess. It is fixing to come a storm. I better get this stuff stacked down here and covered up. It's fixing to come a storm. This is a big movie score. Okay. There. I gotta stand up. Yep, this is gonna be high on my list. Oh, there's some lightning. Yeah, I need to get my decrepit old tail in the house. I do not trust lightning, and I hear it. I hear it. Like that. Now these, they might be dry. Okay. Let me get this covered up. Let me put them right there. Folks, am I nuts? Am I absolutely nuts for even wanting to hang on to... I mean, this is old school stuff. But... Alright, I'm gonna... Set that up there. Set that there. And here it comes. You want to go in, Diamond? Uh -huh. You want to go in, baby boy? Let's go inside. Let's go lightning. Well, I'm stranded again. This yard getting where it needs mowing again. Oh, gee whiz. something I've wondered about it don't amount to a hill of beans 
but when it comes to rain like this right here just say in this one square block area how many how many gallons of water is coming down in a minute how many gallons It's got to be pretty substantial. I suppose I could fill a gallon jug out there just up completely open and let it rain in it and see how much gets in that jug in a minute. And then you can figure it out from the foot square feet you got. How stupid is that? Why would anybody even want to know that? But I just wonder how many gallons of water is coming out of that sky. How many gallons of water is up there in the sky? Is it a lot? I wonder where my grandson is. He, his car's gone. Our garbage didn't get picked up the other day, and I wonder what's up with that. And I still, I, somebody sell a bag of cans out there beside the driveway by the tree. And sometimes my daughter will, uh, come in the yard to unload groceries or something and she runs over that bag and she's just about flattened all them cans. And I see a damn car. I swear, I, I, not damn, I see a dang car. I'm gonna edit the damn out. But there's a car in it. Where in the world did that come from? Now I get fussed at about my messes, but there's messes around here. There's that car laying there. And look at all this stuff down through here. I didn't put none of that there. There's a bottle. There's a bag of something. That pipe, I found that curb scrapping one there. There's a screen laying over there. There's two jugs over there, a jug there. Some paperwork there. I didn't do all that. But when they talk about crash laying around, they generalize, and when they generalize, that means I'm making the mess. Does that make sense? It don't to me. It don't. I love these rainstorms. If it gets lightning too bad, though, I don't. Uh, I, I'm gonna have to go in. It's blowing in on me now. Get in the water.